Welcome to the News Bulletin Live on TBP TV, sponsored by TBP Professionals Institute and Chai Fans. I'm Nana Ifia Akwa. Coming up today, voting for Mahama will reverse Ghana's progress, Akufuado. A Black was Slams government for failing to aid Akosombo Dam victims. Now, in the news in detail, President Nana Dodankwa Akufuado has cautioned that a vote for John Dramani Mahama and the National Democratic Congress in the upcoming December 7 elections would lead Ghana back to a period of underdevelopment and hardship. He argued that Mahama and the NDC have nothing new to offer the country and urge Ghanaians to reject them at the polls. Speaking during the short cutting ceremony for the expansion of the Tamamoto Way, President Akufuado emphasized that Dr. Mahamudu Baomia is the best candidate to lead Ghana's development and ensure continued progress. We are going forward. We are not going back to the era of stagnation and non-performance. We are going forward with Dr. Mahamudu Baomia to a better, more inclusive and more prosperous Ghana. In other news, Samuel Okujeto Ablakwa, Member of Parliament for North Tongue has expressed outrage over the government's prolonged failure to assist individuals affected by the Akosombo Dam spillage. Despite the disaster occurring almost a year ago, many affected persons remain in camps without receiving compensation or necessary support to resume their lives. Addressing a stakeholder public hearing, Ablakwa revealed that over 1,300 affected persons still live in camps, criticizing the government's approach as inadequate. He highlighted the government interministerial committee's failure to engage with MPs from impacted areas, despite being established to address the issue. Moving on, Dr. Mahamud Baumia, the flag bearer of the New Patriotic Party, has assured traders and businesses that his government will address the challenges they face in assessing funds. During a tour of the Ablekuma North and Ablekuma West constituencies, Dr. Baumia highlighted his commitment to making access to capital easier for traders and small and medium-sized enterprises. Dr. Baumia proposed two initiatives to support businesses a Women's Trade Empowerment Fund, and an SME bank. He emphasized that funding is the primary challenge facing traders and SMEs, and his government is committed to providing solutions. The NPP flag bearer engaged with traders and stakeholders during his tour, which included meet-and-greet sessions, stakeholder engagement, and community events. He reiterated his promise to improve the lives of Ghanaians through a credit score system and emphasized his commitment to supporting traders and SMEs. To end the news, a recap of the headline. Baumia promises funding for traders and SMEs. That's all for News Bulletin Live on TBP TV, sponsored by TBP Professionals Institute and Chai Fans. I'm Nana Ifia Aqua. Stay tuned for more news.